You may have missed this one last week amid all the hoopla at Champs, but here he is again. Track star Johan Blake raising his personal profile as he once more raised his hopes of an elusive gold medal at the upcoming Olympics. Blake comes on the outside. Some people say a born in our time where it's hard. <laughs> Overshadowed by Bolt. You're my teammate and I respect you, but I'm the greatest. I was in the shadow, to be honest, but I break away from that shadow and I've created my own legacy. And Johan Blake, for the second time in three days, delivers a beating on the world's best, Usain Bolt. Always the shy guy. I watch eight movies every day, so I'm more to myself. But right now, taking to social media with his love life and angling for big screen roles in Bollywood. I go to the gym practically every day, five days of the week. Johan Blake pumping iron to keep in the fast lane as he sets his sights on gold later this year in France. But his build up to the Olympics also about more of a public profile. There was that interview with Sim, which led to being on the receiving end of sometimes explicit offers from amorous women. And he's talking up his foundation, catering to homeless kids. I have three homes in Jamaica. Kids that have been raped, some young girls that have been pregnant at the age of 12. We have found them and we have, made, and we have put them into the homes. We have given them scholarship to go to England, to go to France and study. Over 30 had kids. Living rough. Living rough and we have built a complex to host the kids and it, it run me over a million US. Sounds like a lot, but Johan Blake's done well from running. Happy here to flash a bit of bling to remind us Usain isn't the only one to have cleaned up from endorsements and a track invitationals. I've been in races where it's just me and Usain was the highest paid athlete for more chairs. You know, every time I finish the season, I can smile. I have a beautiful home. I have everything that I wanted. You don't have to worry about anything else ever in life you're taken care of. You have millions in the bank. I have millions on my hand. I don't worry about anything. Is, is that customized? Is that yeah, made is just what, for you? This, this definitely, this is just like 50 pieces of them make. So it's just, it's just for me. So this alone can make me live happily ever after. He has a good life, but had hoped for so much more going up against the best, like Bolt, who delivered early on the promise of his talent. By contrast, Blake faltered. Do you think you've measured up to those expectations? I would say no, in some aspect, because I got injured when I was supposed to take over on the real stage, and um, that set me back a lot. I don't think I've lived up to what I want myself to be in the sport. How much did that injury derail your hopes and dreams? My muscle came off my bone, you know, so it, it, it really hampered me a lot and it, it wasn't easy. I get better physically, but mentally I wasn't okay. The Paris Olympics will be Blake's last, so nothing now to lose. And he's loosened up too in other ways. Inviting, but also fending off love interest from countless women after a TV interview revealed his single status. I have over 20,000 emails, a female's messaging me. <laughs> I say, oh, you and um, I'm available. Um, I know I'm too old, but something can work. I know you're, you're not going to let me. I'm fat. I said, no, don't say that to yourself. Aren't you scared of gold diggers? I am, but I am, I know them. So tell me. You're this wealthy guy, you're a sports star. How can you be single? I see my parents and have a type of love that I want and I don't, and nobody have brought that to me as yet. I have run so much race in my life, I've vomited on the track. I'm not going to give away myself just like that. When I go home, there's no stress. I can keep my phone up, I don't have to turn it down. And at the same time, you don't have anybody calling you and say, yo, my bills need to pay. What you can do to help me, I'm hungry. So I'm, when I go, I'm free. I lie down, there's no stress. What's the craziest pitch that a woman has made to you as a result of getting all of these emails and messages? I'll get a, a naked video. I say, come have me. <laughs> yeah, man. <laughs> so I'll tell you, they'll do anything. So I, 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 open, I open this file and I'll see this lady say, Yon, I'm all yours. How did you respond? <laughs> 
I didn't respond enough. I only, I, I was surprised, I was shocked. And I said, really? You don't even shave? Asked him if he'd do a reality TV show around his love life. His response, he'd been approached by Bollywood to make his big screen debut. I love movies, a series. There's going to be a lot of romantic scenes because I'm all about that. It should be fun, <laughs> I can't say much. Except that he had to bear all during an audition in India. The toughest thing was to get um, naked on set. And, Stark uh, naked. Yeah, yeah, you have to stand up naked. It's just, just to, you know, so you're, you're not afraid to take on any scene. Because I grew up very, very humble, shy. It was hard for me. I did have to do it in the dressing room before. Then I, then I just walk up with my eye closed. Anyway, you put your best foot forward. <laughs> well, yeah, I did. And I, at first, I was, I sweat, I sweat, I sweat, I sweat going out, and my arm was sweating. You know, and my back sweat was running down my back, and and you know, I just closed my eye, and I know I was out there, and um, and I was all right. And at least you didn't have to worry about not being in shape. Yeah, well, well, everybody, woo, yeah. What with acting, cricket commentary, and opening a restaurant in Miami, there's a lot on Johan Blake's plate. But one big dream remains. What did you want to accomplish in track and field that you didn't? And so it's a, it's a regret that haunts you I, 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 till today. I think you a gold medal at the Olympics. I've got silver. Huh? <laughs> but I need an interview, a gold medal, and I'm, I will be satisfied. I already have times, I have fastest times, so I'm good. I have world records, so I'm, I just need an interview, a gold medal. You think you're going to get one this time around? I know I'm going to do it this time around.